Newbie reporting for duty with the old school OG Vaznev 9K submachine gun. She used to be the king of the battlefield in Modern Warfare 2, but since has it fallen by the wayside? Here's the configuration I'll be using. The Vaznev with the Renetti and the Jack Ferocity kit as my secondary weapon. I start with the Spiral version 3.5 flash hider. It does a lot to control the various recoils while harming ADS speed a bit. To counteract some of that, I put on the XRK Edge BW4 hand stop. It's going to hurt the hip fire spread just slightly and the tack stance spread. The speeds are increased crouch movement a lot, but 45 round mag, always a must for me anyway for free for all. Not much significant red in the mobility. ADS speed, yeah, hurt a little bit again. Reload quickness and empty reload quickness, not fast to begin with. The grip, again, aiming to counteract some of the recoil. I want this to be as accurate as possible. Then finally, the stock, going to try to get some of that those speeds back, although 1 and 2%, they might as well not even <laughs> brag about that. ADS movement speed, though, 3.7. That's going to be key. So let's go into the field of honor and see what happens. We start in sub base free for all. And for those of you who say I play in easy lobbies, I don't know where this one dropped on me, but we'll talk about that in a second. The rival nine pretty much beats the Vaznev in every significant statistic except for bullet velocity. But that doesn't translate into a lot of good for the Vaznev. To be honest, I was expecting the Vaznev to do better. It does have a better kill time in headshots if you can get the mythical headshots in, four of them. But other than that, eh, about the same as a rival. So it all comes down to things like ADS and movement speed and range and gun kick which the rival nine wins in recoil hip fire is about the same performance the rival nine wins by a fairly large margin so anyway on this map i was talking about an easy lobby i spent more than 30 seconds at that point looking for enemy players and that won't be the first time for me on that map you can see i'm behind two to seven a minute and a half to make a kill from one to the next. So I don't know if my kind of blah feeling on the Vaznev came from this map or it came from the Vaznev itself. There's a potential kill. Yes. Behind by six kills. More than half the game gone. Nobody's to 15 kills yet. And I don't know how I survived that. I decided to clear my head with a swim. And it helped a little bit. As I said, you need to keep the shots high with a, uh, with a Vaznev. Well, with any weapon, it probably is good. Hit in the chest, keep it high. I don't know what that guy was doing. But that goes against OSHA health standards in the workplace. Climbing on boxes like that. So the game is mostly complete. Yeah, that guy too. That's against uh, Navy rules to sit on a submarine, a nuclear submarine wing. And I'm only down by five. But with a minute, 50 seconds left, I didn't think I'd be able to find five people. It seemed to me that the Vaznev in this configuration was fairly accurate. But it just took forever to kill somebody. And like I said, maybe it was a lethargic crew on the map here. See if I can use the oldest trick in the book against this guy. Yes. Now we're only down by two. I've got a mosquito. I put that bad boy out. Somebody's trying to put a RPG in my ear or anybody else's ear. And now we're tied. I mean, I'm ashamed to say we're tied on this map. Now I'm somehow in second place, even though we're tied on kills. Looks like the Mosquito drone did some work. 
There's somebody up there. I'll chow him. That was good at distance, and I never saw another player again. There's 30 seconds left of the game, and that's not a Snickers win. Only 17? I can't believe it. So I spit out the bad taste. Grow House was the next map, and at least there were players sometimes moving on it. I like this map. I haven't played it very much. Yeah, chase them around and whoa. Proximity mine did work. The one place that the Vaznev has a clear advantage is in the ADS movement speed. You saw me strafe left to right with that thing and I could barely keep up with the movement. Go my child and do work, my mosquito child. See if I can buffoon my way through a, remote, oh, through a remote turret. The guy kind of made me move a little bit. Then he finessed me and gacked me. But the turret saved my honor. Sh look like I'm shooting at a nun there. A nun and a teal habit. So again, these guys weren't the necessarily every taco in the combination platter of cod, go my child and do work. But it gave, they gave a workout to the Vaznev, and actually I was starting to like it a little bit. There's the teal nun, and there's the teal nun. I'm going to chase her down, and she gacks me. <laughs> you can see my disgust. There's keeping it high, getting the header. Shoot for the melon. The big melon on top. Oh, that's not good. And then again, the aim wasn't wasn't great. Now, at this point, people started camping a little bit. I didn't see anybody for 40 full seconds. The enemy's catching up with me. And head glitches are never a good thing in free-for-all. Neither is just standing there. So we built up a lead again, and I'm moving around. There's another mosquito to add to my family, and sometimes you get gacked putting out that proximity mine. Keeping it high, getting revenge, best served, steaming hot when it's free for all. He's still looking for me up, at the, up in the window. There's an ego chow. That guy was camped there the whole game, and he gacks me. I buy the farm. I threw out a couple bullets when I respawned at him and went after the teal nurse and get gacked. And now all of a sudden it's, well, still a 10-point game. So I thought I could finesse this guy, and he gets me for a second time. Beat me like he caught me stealing his chickens. There's the teal nun. The Vaznev has a short effective range, and it's not good at, at longer range either. There's a series of deaths. I finally get the guy that's camped there throwing out, and somebody else just got him. I saw the blood spray. I'll get them for my final kill, and it is a Snickers win. It's so satisfying. As we're looking at this, this kill cam, my thoughts on the Vaznev, it's okay. It's not going to make a class slot for me a permanent one anyway thanks for watching please like and subscribe helps me helps the family peace